Donald Trump will land in Mexico in a few hours for his first meeting with the foreign leader during the campaign. His visit with President Enrique Peña Nieto happens before his long-awaited speech on immigration policy tonight. This surprise meeting now follows months of very tough talk from the Republican nominee about Mexico and illegal immigration. Major Garrett is in Phoenix, where Trump will speak tonight after traveling to and then from Mexico. Major, good morning to you. Good morning. Donald Trump's hastily arranged trip to Mexico created a media frenzy, just as he hoped. But Trump won't take any reporters with him, and there's precious little time for lengthy, let alone productive, talks with the Mexican president. That might be just as well. President Peña Nieto has criticized Trump's words and his policy talk of a big, beautiful border wall, mass deportations, and the renegotiation of NAFTA. Ahead of a highly anticipated policy speech tonight, Donald Trump hit the safe immigration talking points. We are also going to secure our border and stop the drugs from pouring in. But dodge the issue dogging him for weeks. Deportations of undocumented immigrants living in the U.S. Big speech on immigration. We'll be talking about that. Arizona tomorrow night. Trump also failed to mention a last-minute trip to Mexico, taking up President Enrique Peña Nieto on his invitation. Mussolini, ya se llegó Hitler. Peña Nieto has compared Trump's nationalist rhetoric to World War II dictators Benito Mussolini and Adolf Hitler. And at the White House in July, Peña Nieto praised the North American Free Trade Agreement. Trump vilified the pact last night. We are going to renegotiate the horrible NAFTA trade deal. The Mexican president also knows this Trump call and response performance. Who, who is going to pay for the wall? 100%. And dismisses it without hesitation. There is no way that Mexico can pay a wall like that. On Twitter, Peña Nieto explained the Trump meeting this way. I believe in dialogue to promote Mexico's interests and protect Mexicans. For over a year, Trump rode criticism of Mexico to the Republican nomination. They're bringing drugs, they're bringing crime, they're rapists. Coming across the border are some rough hombres. But the Mexican government forces many bad people into our country. Mexico is just killing us. Former Mexican First Lady Margarita Zavala called that kind of language hate speech, writing to Trump on Twitter, although they have invited you, no, you are not welcome. Though Peña Nieto also invited Hillary Clinton to Mexico, the Democratic nominee with Trump going first must now weigh the risks of appearing to be a copycat. Clinton's campaign did release a statement on all this, which read in part, what ultimately matters is what Donald Trump says to voters in Arizona, not Mexico, and whether he remains committed to the splitting up of families and deportation of millions. Nora? All right, Major, thank you.